Nin explains, stop drinking and smoking now, beating your addiction to alcohol, cigarettes and drugs. Smoking, drinking, drugs. Three of the most common and problematic addictions known to man. If you haven't already watched my video on understanding addiction, I highly recommend you watch that first before carrying on with the rest of this video. I bet you're the person who drinks too much, right? Can't stop smoking even with those annoying patches. And you just can't seem to shake off that annoying heroin addiction. Doing these things can really damage your health. And I don't really need to show you what that looks like, do I? Okay then. Ooh. Uh. Ah! Remember, if you did watch my video on understanding addiction, you'll know that you have attached strong feelings to a thought with a feeling of needing comfort to be happy. And this results in a behavior of you medicating yourself with cigarettes, alcohol, and drugs. Every time you think of a thought that requires some form of comfort or that requires you to want to be happy, you'll reach out for those substances. And this happens every single time. You've actually become very good at this to the point where you don't even consciously think about it. All you have to do is feel a little bit bad and lo and behold, there's a smoke and drink in your hand. It's so easy. You can buy these substances anywhere. You feel that you need this in order to cope. You don't. You just think you do. Now it's time to break the habit. Let's break the association between you thinking a thought and the emotional need for a cigarette, alcohol or drugs. Every time you get a thought in your head and the feeling of wanting a cigarette, wanting a smoke, wanting to shoot up, I want you to say to yourself, stop. I do not want these thoughts. I do not want this stuff. Thank you very much, trash delete. When you do this, I want you to sweep your eyes from right to up to left. You're going in a circular motion. And what I want you to do is imagine the very thing that you're addicted to going around and imagine it going into the bin and out of your mind. Do this every single time that you want a smoke, a drink or some drugs. Stop. I do not want these thoughts. I do not want these things. Thank you very much, Trash Delete. Stop. I do not want these thoughts. I do not want these things. Thank you very much, Trash Delete. Stop. I do not want these thoughts. I do not want these things. Thank you very much, Trash Delete. What you're doing is you're breaking the association between thought and feeling. You're commanding your brain to not react the way it used to. You might be doing it constantly at first, but after a while, you'll be saying the phrase less and less. Your brain relearns to think about its dependency on cigarettes, alcohol, and drugs. And if you can do it for a day, you can do it for two days. If you can do it for two days, you can do it for a week, a month, a year. And in addition to this, I also want you to do the following. Number one, form a healthy environment. If the environment around you is one filled with happiness, love, and variety, you've no need to medicate yourself with cigarettes, alcohol, and drugs. Make sure that you've got a happy and fulfilling life and that you want to stay healthy so that you can enjoy it some more. You'll be too busy enjoying life and being surrounded by people who care about you to even think about that stuff anymore. Get rid of those substances. If you don't have it, you can't take it. So get that stuff out of your house. Avoid triggers. If you go to places that make you want it, such as restaurants, pubs, and clubs, it might be worthwhile to stay away from them for the time being. Remember, we're trying to reduce the chance that you actually reach for your substances. And if you do fail, it's not the end of the world. Get back on that horse and try again. You've probably made more progress than you think. And I know your body might react adversely to coming off stuff cold turkey. But remember, your mind controls your body. Focus on the mind and the body follows. Pretty soon, you'll be enjoying life without the need for substances. If you have found this video at all helpful, please like, share and subscribe. Download my free ebook here, follow me on social media there. And if you've got any questions or comments, let me know in the comment section below. Boy, that was a long one. You might be doing it constantly at first, but the phrasings, the phrasings, the phrasings gave me a word. You might be doing it constantly at first, but the more you use it, the quickly, the quickly you realize, oh boy.